Tyler Rowlinson's Match Day Vlogs, brought to you by Eltham Terrace Club. Specialising in darts, snooker, pool and poker, be sure to get yourself down there and have a great night out with the boys. What's going on guys, Tyler here and welcome to the final pre-season friendly of the 2019-20 campaign. Today, Charlton are up against Premier League opposition in Aston Villa. Now, of course, Aston Villa are going to create a massive test for the Addicts today. They're going to be uh, gunning, um, gunning for it and coming at us because, of course, they need to be in form uh, for the start of the Premier League season. But so do Charlton. Now, I am expecting a defeat today, of course, as Aston Villa are Premier League opposition and... Um, we're still trying to figure figure stuff out uh, before our match against Blackburn. I suspect that we're going to be playing. Obviously, our starting uh, basically our starting eleven for today's game. Um, I'm hoping for a good performance. I'm expecting a loss today, but um, yeah, um, hopefully it'll be a uh, hopefully it'll be a decent performance in the Addicts today. But as I said, I'm not really expecting much today. Um, Villa are class. They got some good players in Jack Grealish, uh, John McGinn, former Charlton player Esri Konza, and Jed Steer as well. Um, and while El Ghazi as well is a decent player. Of course, today is a very special day for one Charlton player in particular, as today is Chris Solly's testimonial game, celebrating 10 years as an addict. He's been with the club since he was 11, and he's been a senior player for 10 years now, and it's an absolutely amazing achievement, and I suspect that he's going to carry on with his career at Charlton, finish his career with us, spend his entire um, entire footballing career with us, and today it's just a celebration, just to, se just to celebrate the years he's had with the club. Hopefully, we can put in a good shift with him, in the side today for his celebration let's get down to the valley for the first time this year and let's hope we can put in hopefully a decent performance against aston villa come on you reds Jason. And now, accompanied by his children, Marlon and Grace, it's the man himself, let's hear it, Chris No, he saw, mate. Very nearly just recreated that own goal against Wembley. There's something not right with his face. I don't know how he's managed to do that. Oh! 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 Just past the 20 minute mark by now, and we're actually doing alright. Actually doing quite well. Uh, been doing well in possession, defensively looked pretty good as well. Still waiting for that final ball, still waiting to d deliver something in the attack, but doing pretty good so far, pretty decent. On the deck a couple of times, winning them three kicks. 
That's what he looks like. Come on, Deji. Come on, Tom. Nah. Unlucky. Come on, win it back, win it back, win it back. Here. Tower to the head of my saw. Don't back pass. No, 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 no! Thank you. <laughs> Villa opened the scoring. Aston Villa won. Charlton nil. Decent, uh, decent play. Greenish ran through, played a decent ball to their striker, who's then just rolled it past Dylan Phillips. Fairly easy. But yeah. Villa take the lead, 1-0. And Wild Garzi with the goal. Charlton, 1-0 down. It's half time at the Valley, it's Charlton 0, Aston Villa 1. Um, we may be 1-0 down, but to be honest, it's been a pretty decent performance. Can't really say we've done much wrong. Defensively, we've been pretty decent. Uh, our midfield looks all right. We need to get a couple more attacks going in the final third. But other than that, it's been a pretty decent performance. Um, Good to see new signing Dejo Shilaja in action today. He's kind of filling in Christian Bielik's old role that he had last year, like coming like, like his defensive midfielder, but also sitting back as a centre back. And to be honest, he's done quite well so far. But all in all, maybe one nil down. But it's a pretty decent performance. Pretty decent. Bring on the second half. Second half just kicked off. First chance of the game so far. Chucks and Ike got put through after Taylor intercepted the ball. Played in an Ike. He ran through. Had a shot. Good save by Jed Steer. We've won a corner. Come on, Charlton. Still can't get over the first man. Well done, Ashinaja. Well done, Deji. Lovely Jay. Good Darren. Unlucky. Good, good start to the second half. Been a good start. Villa double their money, 2-0. Opened us up too easily there. Can't really complain really. I mean, Andre Green has just come off the bench. It's a 2-0. Can't really complain really. Still been a good performance from us, but didn't really expect anything else, did we? we expected to lose this game, but it's been a decent performance, but it's Charlton nil, Aston Villa 2. 3-0 Villa. Long shot on the edge of the box. As we, I mean, it's what I expected really, but that could be the floodgates opening now. We could be seeing a thump in now, but oh well. It was expected, it was expected really. Charlton nil, Aston Villa three. Come on! No, Taylor! Taylor stepping up against Jed Steer. Carlisle. Yeah! Come back! get one back. Charlie one, Villa three. Get in there, Lyle. Well done. Very casual. Well done, Lyle. We may be 3 1 down, but you know what? We're playing well, and we're playing really well. There's some really, there's some good movement in the uh, final first. Really good movement, and I'm, I've been impressed. I've been impressed. We're doing, doing quite well. We're attacking quite well the second half, and we're definitely getting a lot more chances. Come close quite a few times. I'm impressed. Well done, lads. Opened up too easily again. Charlton one, Villa four. Opened up again. What's happened, for, what's happened for all of our goals? John McGinn was second in the afternoon. For all, for all four of our games, we've been opened up too easily. But, yeah, I didn't expect anything less, to be honest. But, yeah, 4 1. Right, it's over at Chris Solly's testimonial game. Charlton Athletics pre season closes in a defeat. 
Charlton 1, Aston Villa 4 is the full-time score. At the end of the day, we just got opened up too easily in defence for their goals. Far too easy for them. Just basically just walked through us and got the goal. But got the goals. But we did show some decent patches of football, decent patches of movement throughout the game. Uh, of course, Lyle Taylor putting away the penalty. Um, but we looked decent, um, looked decent in some areas. And to be honest, I thought we we played quite well today. Pretty decent performance. I think that that lineup's probably the closest it will be to the starting eleven against Blackburn next week. Um, so, to be honest, I think we're doing. I think we we played well, but hopefully that result today, which was a bit of a battering, hasn't not hasn't not the team's confidence before before Saturday. But yeah, I will see you all on Saturday for the first matchday vlog of the 2019-20 uh, season against Blackburn Rovers at Ewood Park. This been Tyler and have a nice day, and I'll see you all then full time. At Chris Solly's testimonial, Charlton Reflect 1, Aston Villa 4. See you later.